Someone's spawning back here. I don't know. Yep. There's this guy. There's this guy. There's this guy. Thankfully, it's... Oh, what is this gun? Yo, what's going on, guys? And welcome back to Modern Warfare 3. With the Season 2 Reloaded update, they actually added a brand new sector to the Battle Pass. And one of the rewards for this sector is the Jack Burnout Kit for the Holger LMG. I'm not gonna lie, the Holger 26 is one of the most forgettable weapons in this game. With the Jack Burnout Kit, it actually increases the fire rate, the damage fall off, the bullet velocity, and the limb damage. You're probably wondering why is it called the burnout kit well this is why and the tip of your gun is on fire because of how much you shot i'm a huge fan of these aftermarket parts and if you guys are too go down below and drop a like on the video i want sledgehammer to keep putting in these unique attachments it spices up the game quite a bit Alrighty, fellas we have the jack burnout kit i'm not gonna lie with you guys i completely forgot that there was a holger lmg in this game oh what the f I honestly thought the Holger was only an assault rifle. And I completely forgot about this gun. But again, this is why I absolutely love the aftermarket parts that Sledgehammer have been adding. It makes it so all of these forgettable guns are actually relevant again, and they mean something. So that's really damn sick. Also, this gun has a 100 round magazine because it is an LMG. So the fact that we can literally just keep shooting and not have to worry about reloading, and also, this is a jack burnout kit, so the more we shoot, the more on fire our barrel is. I just think this is sick, man. I'm not gonna lie. What an awesome, awesome update. So, I have no idea where any of these guys are. I'm assuming one guy's, like, right here. Wait. Okay. Okay, wow. The fire rate on this gun is crazy. We're basically rocking attachments that increase the recoil control, but even then, it, it, there's still a lot of recoil to manage. It's these type of attachments that really remind me of Black Ops 4. I'm not gonna lie with you. Black Ops 4 had... Oh my god, I almost got destroyed. Black Ops 4 had those, like, attachments, those operator mods that truly changed the game. Wait, there's a guy, I think, right here. Oh my god, I'm so screwed. I'm gonna throw a Semtex right there. I don't know why I have Semtex on. Dude, Oh my god, what is going on right now? I don't even think I have the right perks and attachments set up right now. I'm gonna use this advance. I'm gonna get this kill. There's a guy behind me. There's literally a guy behind me. Just keep shooting, just keep shooting, just keep shooting, just keep shooting, just keep shooting. I don't even have to reload. I don't have to reload. My gun is on fire right now. We're gonna use this EMP. I think there's a guy behind me. Wait, no, no, no. There, there's definitely people here. There's one guy. There's two. Dude, the fact that I don't have to stop shooting is ridiculous. These guys are definitely going to come through, I think. I don't know. My chopper is kind of going crazy. There's a guy right here. He's just trying to knife and try to be annoying. We're on a 17. Wait, did that guy have ghosts? I don't even think I saw that guy on the minimap. Hello? I low-key need a scavenger. I might be dead. I might be dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm stunned. Wait, teammate. Oh my god. Teammate literally saved me. That guy is a sweat on the enemy team. I literally... Oh my god, the Semtex actually just saved me. That was a horrible Semtex throw. I'm dead. No, he spawned behind me. And also, I don't know if you guys knew this, but Sledgehammer actually made one of the best updates when it comes to multiplayer. All right. Sledgehammer made one of the best updates when it comes to multiplayer, and it's something that I've actually wanted for a very, very long time. So essentially with MW3, uh, when it comes to the stim shots, you only had... Oh my god. You only had two stim shots. That was the most you can actually have on your class setup. But after this most recent update, they made it so you can actually get more stim shots after like 20 seconds or something like that. I'm not even sure, but if I use my stim shot, I'm, I can. I use this and now hopefully my stim shot should come back after like 20 seconds. I mean, at least that's what Sledgehammer said. I don't know if you have to have like a specific perk on. So far, I still have no stim shots. Do you? Oh, wait. I just got it back. What? Dude, why do I keep getting stunned this game, bro? Dude, I'm stunned again. Why are these people being so annoying? I'm just gonna have to sit in the back right here. I can't even move right now. What the fuck? Bro, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I have the chopper. No, no, no. Let's get some ammo real quick. If we can get this advance, I feel like we'll be chilling. Oh my God, dude. What? Oh my God, I got the advance. Wow. I've just been literally pinned back here, not being able to move. Dude. Oh my gosh, I got the EMP. This is perfect. This is literally perfect. This game is so close. Hello? Hello? We're gonna kill him. These guys are EMP'd now. 
Wait. Kill him. Kill him. Hello? Hello? Is anyone here? Hello? Hello? Oh my god. What the? Oh. I think I'm on like a 20 kill streak right now. <gasps> Where the flip did you come from? What the heck? This has been one of the craziest games I've ever played. Come on! Oh my gosh. Grab this tag. We won! Let's go, baby! I feel like this is one of those games where, like, I probably can't move much, honestly. Just because of how these guys are playing, they're very much like, hey, I'm gonna just rush and push you. And if I also push at the same exact time, we're just gonna be button ahead. It's not gonna end well. It's not gonna be a chance for me to actually streak up, like, and, and drop streaks on these guys, essentially, so... I, they're, they're probably all to my left. Dude, why are you laying on the ground? It's TDM, so it's not like... There's not like there's much time and things to even do. Yeah, I just can't even push up. There's a guy pushing up, I'm pretty sure. The spawns are probably going to favor them. Got an Overwatch Hilo. I, I got to run. I'm just going to probably play this central area right now. Got an assist maybe on that guy. Yep, got an assist. Definitely a dude to my right. Guy behind me. I got to back up. I got to back up. It could also spawn to my left. Dude, these spawns are ridiculous, man. I need help. I need help, dude. I need ammo as well. Just gotta reload. I'm dead. Got the events. Okay, pop the events. Got the EMP. We gotta pop this EMP right now. They're all over me. I might be dead. I'm not sure. Might be dead. I don't know. I'm just gonna back up. Need. I need to reload. This guy's might be coming through. Okay, we're good. All right, I gotta finish reloading. There's not a lot of time. Like, it's only TDM, so we really can't do much. So this is a very, very, like, hit or miss type of game, to be honest. But it's one of those fun ones, honestly. It's one of those fun ones where I'm probably not gonna drop a nuke. I don't have a lot of time. But at least we can maybe, like, just get something. There's a guy, like, behind us as well. There's, like, two guys here in the middle. This guy's on the outside. He's not pushing up. We're good. I think this guy like literally sitting right here. Got him. Got him. Oh my god, I'm on a 20. Dude, I'm actually on a 20. I don't know what to do here. <laughs> I don't know what to do here. I'm probably dead. This guy right here. I'm probably very, very dead. Oh, they have a VTOL? How did these guys get a VTOL in a helicopter? I am very confused. I'm on a 22. The helicopter will probably end up just killing me right now. I can't move. I can't do anything. They have a VTOL and a helicopter. Come on. What do you mean by that? Dude. Dude, oh my God. This gun is ridiculous. Wait, that's him. We have an EMP. We're gonna have to use that for sure. We're gonna have to use that for sure. Oh no, oh no. I'm dead. Really? Those spawns? Are you kidding? Dude. All right, well, my EMP is up. So honestly, it's fine because we probably can still build up a streak. I don't think we can. This is ridiculous. Uh, no, like this is actually getting out of hand. How am I still dying? And they're, e they're all EMP'd. It it's the spawns, dude. It's it's genuine. It's the spawns, the spawns, and now they keep throwing nades. I don't really get the, the issue here. I don't really get this the issue. I don't. I, everyone just needs to calm down. Personally, everyone. Dude, everyone needs to calm down. What? What is this, man? I need just ammo. There's a guy to my left. Wow. <gasps> How many nades? Oh no. I'm dead. Dude, this gun is ridiculous. Please don't spawn in front of me. 
EMP. I need this advance up. I need this advance up. I need this advance up. Please, please call it in. These guys could still spawn in front of me. I think we're okay now. I think we're okay. Pretty shot, guys. Dude, the spawns. The second I reload, I feel like they always spawn in front of me. I need, I need ammo. I have nothing. Please don't spawn in front of me. Please don't spawn. I mean, behind me. Okay. Okay. I got a bunch of ammo. I got a bunch of ammo. There's a guy right here in the middle. He's dead. We got a guy coming around. We got him. Hello? Come on. I need to reload. I think I'm one off. I'm one off. Come on. Wait. There we go. Oh my god, dude. I didn't think I was going to drop this game just because of just how much was going on and just how bad the spawns are. Oh my god, man. Let's just keep going. I guess I guess we just keep going, right? Dude, what are these spawns? Dude, why is there a freaking You know what? I'm going to call it in. I don't care. At this point, man, I just don't care. I do not care, but this gun's insane. Alrighty, guys, so for this class setup, of course, you're rocking the Jack Burnout Kit. This weapon is just absolutely unfair. A lot of recoil to manage and everything like that, but this is a really cool conversion kit. For the optic, we're running the Jack Glassless Optic. This is another aftermarket part that you can unlock, I believe, through the week four challenges. So this is definitely a really, really good optic to run, and it really fits this weapon. Next up for the underbrow, the Chimera Rin Vertical Grip. This is one of the best underbrows you can run, especially for re uh, vertical recoil and just recoil gun kick. Uh, minus 13%, minus 12%, a really good underbarrel. For the magazine, I definitely prefer the 100 round drum. The fire around this thing is absolutely insane. I don't think you can have anything less than 100. And finally, for the rear grip, the Morn 20 grip uh, for even more gun kick control, recoil control, you get honestly some pretty good buffs. Overall, man, I just love how they took a pretty irrelevant gun and made it relevant. And that's what I absolutely love. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.